Lyft, one of the hotter innovative startups that it's found its way to Boston, bringing with it pink mustaches. The whole idea behind it is just like someone, a friend giving a friend a ride. Lyft is a service that connects people who need rides with everyday car owners. Unlike other car sharing services, Lyft does not charge you for rides. Instead, you can give suggested donations to drivers. You're part of some kind of community or friends group and they're just like throwing you a few bucks for gas or just to be nice. Since coming to Boston in July, Lyft has been working to establish itself amongst other car sharing services. Uber is like a big competition for us. Um, so we kind of battle it out with Uber, but. As part of its on-demand convenience strategy, you can only request a ride through their application on a smartphone. And sometimes drivers give passengers more than just a ride. Give out food, I fist bump. That's what I do. <laughs> People are friendly and like actually want to give their riders a good experience as opposed to just putting them in the back seat and not caring. And why the pink mustaches? Kind of a goofy front and diffuse sort of some of the like unsafeness people might feel. It comes off less threatening if people were ever worried about that. While passengers here in Boston are enjoying the benefits that these car sharing services such as Lyft have to offer, cab industry feels a little different. The, the city has been lacking in educating the public as to what is, what is a licensed Boston, Boston taxi cab look like. App only companies have responded to allegations by saying, well, we're not transportation providers. This doesn't apply to us. There are laws on the books which clearly define what and who is allowed to transport people for hire in the city of Boston. And we feel that all is needed is the proper, maybe, lobbying of a congressman or a senator to sit down and enforce the law that's already on the books. Lyft could have its hands full as taxi cab regulators and lobbyists refuse to go down without a fight. However, as ride sharing services such as Lyft continue to expand to top U.S. cities, don't be surprised if you see more of Boston's cars growing pink mustaches. For BU News Services, this is Iris Moore.